Welcome to the Kidnapped Princess from Omnimedia. is to find out where the Princess Abigail has gone. To do this, you'll have to find the items I ask you for. They'll be hidden around the rooms of the castle. And Lucky okay. and Duck will go wherever you send him and help with their retrieval. To guide Lucky about the castle, move the cursor around the room you're in. When the cursor changes to an arrow, you can click and Lucky will travel to that part of the castle. If the cursor changes to a hand, able to access parts of the adventure. If the cursor changes to a speaker, click and listen. Moving the cursor to the bottom of the screen provides you with various controls. From left to right, the hand allows you to exit from a puzzle or story sequence to the castle tour or finish your quest. The disc allows you to save and load game sessions. The potion bottle will scan me onto the screen and I'll provide you with some hints and help. I want you to start by finding the Great Hall. I want you to start by finding the Great Hall. I've always wanted to try this. See what it feels like to be the king. Hey, not bad. By royal charter, I hereby decree that all ducks shall be given <laughs> pawns of their own. That's it. You got it. One each. And that all humans shall hereby be made to spend all their money purchasing bread and spend all their time throwing said bread to said ducks on, uh, said pond. Nah, nah, not me. As soon as everyone does what you say, it gets less fun. Besides, I'm not that fat. where it all began, just an ordinary sort of supper time in the life of the royal. Uh, oops. That 
was a loud one. Where's my supper? It's ready, dear. I may look like I taste good, but I don't. I'm stringy and tough, wiry and thin, all flesh and bones. I'd have something else if I were you. Abigail, it's supper time. Well, Lucky, you'll do for another time. Tonight we're having something else. Whew, that was close. You know, I've been watching this lot. That king especially. He's a weirdo. Isn't Abigail down yet? Your daughter seems to take forever getting ready for supper. Paige, fetch my daughter! I'll fetch the girl that's loved the most From mountaintop to long flat coast Her clear blue eyes and long brown hair Will drive you into deep despair What gastronomic extravaganza Are you going to fill my belly with this evening, my dear? You're having a stew left over from yesterday Dumplings, a mound of potatoes and boiled cabbage Vegetables? Yuck. Stew? Yuck. Why not beef? Because I organize the food. And besides, certain foods contain a high proportion of saturated fats and are only to be eaten in moderation. <laughs> what on earth is moderation? Better still, why not duck? A bit of that mincing duck. Quackers, or whatever you call it. Sounds quite appetizing. His name's Lucky. <laughs> Wouldn't be if I got hold of him. The Princess Abigail, so fair. Can't be found, not anywhere. That girl that people dream of kissing. Won't be down, cause she's gone missing. Not there. Of all your habits, that's the worst. Saying again what I said first. Where is she? I don't know, man. I don't know where that lovely princess go. Oh, my daughter, my beautiful daughter. Where can she be? The guards who watch from in the tower say they saw that little flower on her horse and all hogtied with a knight in black right by her side. Tied up? Why is it each and every day you repeat the things I say? Repeat myself? Me? I don't, you know, I don't, I don't. She, she, she must have been kidnapped. Kidnapped? There has to be a note. There's always a note. Find the note! Go to the kitchen. Magical, lyrical, melodical, soulful, joyful. As the bard said, music had powers to smooth the wrinkled vest. Or something like that. Toneful, rhythmical, magical, lyrical, melodical, soulful, joyful. As the bard said, a note. Hmm? Well, come to think of it, I'd probably choose the kitchen. is in his counting house, counting out his money. This is it. I have found it. I keep some scrolls as well. And to read the one you've just found, you'll have to find mine. They're in my laboratory. Of course, you could go via the wanted poster, a sort of shortcut. Fifty-five. Wasn't a good, uh, beer. 
The grapes came on too early, and the noble rots never set in, which meant that the slopes on the south sides of the hills got all the light, and then the soil became too hot and dried out, and then the labor wasn't available to, uh, uh, excuse me, are you still awake? I remember this occasion. Why, that king was even nasty to Muggins, the only person in the world who could help him. Well, Muggins, what nonsense have you got for me today? I'd like your magisterial holiness to consider various aspects of the English language. The king's English, huh? huh. Well, what are they then? Please, thank you, and well done. Oh, why on earth would you want me to do a rash thing like that, old chap? I think that an appreciation of those words might endear you to more people within the kingdom and the commonwealth. Endear me to people? Ha! That's the last thing I want to do. You're lucky I don't lop off your head like all the others. I keep some scrolls as well. And to read the one you've just found, you'll have to find mine. They're in my laboratory. Of course, you could go via the wanted poster, a sort of shortcut. <laughs> of course, food has always been the king's strongest point. Crunchy, munchy, delightful, divine. I just love eating all of the time. A plate is great if it's filled to the brim. Pieces with fries spilling over the rim. Whatever it is, if it's eaten, it's bliss when it's put on the table. I'll grin. For burgers and beef, I'll slip in my teeth and pick up my fork and duck in. Oh, plus charming with ham, a glutton I am. I'll eat it all night and all day. If you leave in the fridge just the tiniest smidge of food, I will wolf it away. I love my food, all of my food. Since I started to eat, each day's been a treat. First two meals, then three, and now four. Even after the crumbles, my tummy still rumbles, and I have just a little bit more. I was told for a dare that the larder was bare. No food in the house to be found. But my ravenous looks so fan. frightened the cook that I chased her around and around. My love, my food. some scrolls as well. And to read the one you've just found, you'll have to find mine. They're in my...
Shoes for horses, not for web feet. I think that Lucky has been spying again. Oh, this fuss over a sheep stealer. I should lock. A lot of them up and throw away the key. I don't know why I'm so nice to them. You're not. You're as nasty as anyone could be. In fact, a good deal nastier than most. Huh. I should lop off your head as well. And who would prepare all that food you love so much? I'd buy a chef. <laughs> a lot cheaper if you ask me. I keep some scrolls as well. And to read the one you just found, you have to find mine. They're in my laboratory. Of course, you could go via the wanted poster, a sort of shortcut. That's what's called a breastplate. The trouble is, when I hear the words breast and plate, I begin to feel very strange. In fact, I come over in a cold sweat. Nope, she's not in there. Revolting. What did they feed you on, Silver? I have never seen a pooper scooper big. Ugh, yuck! That is revolting. What did they feed you on, Silver? I have never seen a pooper scooper big. Get the idea. She's not in there. Just you try that again. Okay, I'll just keep going till you stop me. Where to? Where to now?
la 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 la. Is that you, princess? Nope. She ain't in there. in his counting house, counting all his money, and Queen is in the larder, behaving really funny. We've heard this one before. Let's look somewhere else. I had a rather taxing interview with the King. Muggins. The peasants will pay an extra tax levy of five bushels per acre. And what would one like to do about the alleged sheep stealer? Well, what do we normally do about the sheep stealers? You chop, chip, chop their heads off, your oneness. Seems the logical thing to me. Uh, but the allegation is unproven, Majestiness. Doesn't matter. Lop off his head. Yes, your nastiness. No one left to pay the tax at this rate. I keep some scrolls as well. And to read the one you've just found, you'll have to find mine. They're in my laboratory. Of course, you could go via the wanted poster, a sort of shortcut. Queen discovered that Abigail had been kidnapped. They took the ransom note to the Great Hall to read it. Those were wedding presents. Revolting, weren't they? Oh, never mind that now. When the king is in his counting house, counting out his money... See? It's your fault. Damn, the queen is in the larder. Behaving really funny. Then daughters will be kidnapped, or so the story's told. Kidnapped? Oh, no, you were right. Not my daughter. By people who will exchange her for piles and piles of gold. Mm -hmm. Call Muggins the magician. He'll unravel the mystery. I'll go right now and fetch the man. The one who makes the slickest plan. If I, uh, I might adventure, sir? Not now, man. Can't you see I'm busy? Uh, yes, but, sir, uh, I, uh... I said not now, Longsword. Uh, yes, sir. All this fuss is really stupid. That king's one of those guys, you know. Well, Muggins, who would kidnap my beautiful daughter? Who would be bold, brave, and foolish enough? They must have left a clue. If your majesty would just take a few moments to look around, I think you'll find that, as always in life, the clues are simply everywhere. Yes, but where? As I said, everywhere. Oh, never mind the clever talk. Where on earth is my daughter? She's such a sweet girl, and you've not shown your love all those wasted years. You've just been too busy recently, kinging and things. Sometimes I'll find I'm... Search his room. 
The next step is to find a poster of an evil desperado, a wanted man. wrong with magic as long as you're careful watch out for the magic mistakes can be tragic turning young men into frogs small girls into smelly dogs slimy snails and horses tails add a bit of human spit then some stagnant water too Spells each magician tells Abradabra, Abradu. Remember, that's the one for you. Add a burr of rabbit's fur. Stir the pot till it gets hot. Sprinkle dust and watch it flash. Be careful not to let it splash. Magic. Mistakes can be tragic. Turning princes into bats, old men into squealing rats. Now the broom has boiled for hours. I'll sprinkle it upon these flowers. I'll place some shields upon these men. You have to zap them one to ten. Watch out for the magic. It needn't be tragic. It can turn soldiers into frogs or bats and rats and angry dogs. step is to find a poster of an evil desperado, a wanted man.
I don't think she's in there, but I guess you never know. Ooh. Ah, close, huh? Singing donkeys? Whatever next. <laughs> Talking ducks, perhaps. is to find a poster of an evil desperado, a wanted man. I think he'd rather not go down there. Still, who needs his opinion? Inside the dungeon, it's dark. And as black as a hole deep in space. Cobwebs that cling to your hair. And it looks like a... Horrible I don't want to go down there, I'd like to stay up here. It's not that I am frightened or petrified by fear. It's just that the mouth of this dungeon looks like an entrance to hell. With bars on the walls and the windows and probably spiders as well. the screams and the cries that makes me think something gruesome is happening deep down inside. That screamer is not being tickled or fed with some nice things to eat. He's more likely now being pickled or barbecued like some fresh meat. side of that door. I think that if I go down there, I'll finish up just slightly dead. So why not do what I think we should and send down the duckling instead?
The next step is to find a poster of an evil desperado, a wanted man. The room search was successful, for they found an ominous sign, a black-hearted dagger. It was Blackheart. This is his dagger. Uh, that's, that's right, sir. I saw it ages ago. Then why didn't you say so, man? Well, you told me to shut up, uh, sir. Never. I would never say a thing like that. Where's this scoundrel's castle? Castle Blackheart, sir? Of course, you blithering idiot. Where do you think I mean? Carnegie Hall? Where, sir? You know, I once watched the king talking with the queen. Never mind. Where's the blooming castle? Uh, right, I'll, I'll, I'll show you, sir. Uh, no, it's this one. Uh, uh, I think. Uh, uh, no, wait a minute. Uh, it's, it's this one. Uh, this one here. Or is it this one? Well, which one is it? Um, well, I don't know. Fool. Muggins! <laughs> Which... which one is it, Muggins? Pretty obvious, I would have thought. Even a man interested in nothing but money ought to be able to tell. Well, he can't. Ask a page and look no more, cause that's the one you're looking for. How do you know? It might have something to do with the black heart painted on it. Oh, yes, I see it now. Get my horses, my knights, my armies. We must rescue the princess! Um... Uh, don't you think that perhaps we should, well, take a little... Food? <laughs> Good idea. Uh, no, no, some... Extra clothes. It's midsummer. Uh, no, no, no. W uh, what I mean is that we'll need... Fresh horses. Now, that is a good idea. Uh, no, no. I, I just think that we might... Spit it out, man. Well, don't interrupt him, then. All right, all right. What is it? M money, gold, uh, that sort of thing. Ah. That is a good idea. A few bars of gold ought to do it. The group set off towards Castle Blackheart. When's lunch? We haven't got all night, you know. I suppose we'll get there in the end. Eventually, they arrived at a junction of five paths. Many ghosties and ghoulies awaited our intrepid rescuers on their search for Blackheart's castle. You'll be able to help them only when you found the skulls that I keep. Hooves in the distance provided a clue as to which path to follow. I don't think it could be that way. Would you like to save your current game? 
please enter a name for your saved session. Where do they always come from? a good time to suggest uh, turning back. Ah! Uh, what was that? Where do they always come from? Get yourselves in walking gear, cause this is one path that is clear. This way! Oh, no. Well, I, I think I might be allergic to uh, uh, leaves. That's it. I'm allergic to leaves. It's this way! You have to find the burial place of a great man. A tomb. at the other end of the woods, they made their way towards Blackheart's castle. Where are my armies? Just above your handies. No, you fool me, fighting men, chaps with swords and bits of metal stuck to their chests. Where are they all? Uh, your armies? Uh, uh, the armies were... Uh, they were sacked, sir. Sacked? What do you mean, fired? Dismissed? Sent packing? What fool would do that? Oh, you did, sir. You said they weren't necessary in today's civilized... Did I? Oh, well, <laughs> doesn't sound like the sort of thing I'd say. Yes, it does. It sounds exactly like the stupid sort of thing you'd say. Still, now we're here at the castle. Out of the that. way! All on our lonesome, no army, no weapons. How are we going to get in? Muggins! Yes, Your Majesty? Find the entrance. Of course, Your Majesty. I'll do the work, and you take the glory. Exactly! Nothing to it. Kazam! Dear Abra Dabra Abra Doom. Normally, a small touch of some delectable spell would do the trick, but I think there may be a problem. Uh, something to do with the winch gear, I think. We'll have to send an agent in there ahead of our party. Lucky is not an expert at mechanics, as I'm sure he's about to prove. He may need your help. Uh, this looks kinda, well, kaput. You know what I'm saying? Hey, how's about you helping me? I'm no good at this mechanical stuff. It's the teeth that frighten me. Know what I mean? Hey there, Lucky. 
Rocky, how you doing? Do I smell some successes, bro? Wow, you've done it! Come on, guys, let's get to the castle. You have to find some crates, like those from a marketplace, or some stocks suitable for incarceration. Our merry band found themselves in a large marketplace. No one about. Blooming odd if you ask me. Oh, uh, is that something over there? Where? Uh, there, inside the inner bailey. Uh, the uh, the prison tower, I think. So what? Uh, well, it's, it, it's it's just that uh, that's where uh, that's where I put her. Who? The the princess. Oh, oh yes, I, I'd quite forgotten. Where'd you say? In the prison tower. What about it? Uh, that's that's where where I'd lock her up. It must be the most uh, fortified place in the castle. Uh, but we'd have to get past that thing, or whatever it is. <laughs> well, come on then, lead the way. Well, Muggins, what do you make of it? No idea, Your Majesty. What? I said I have absolutely no idea. You can't have no idea. Sir? Go outside, Jonathan. Muggins, I pay you to know the answers. No, but sir... I said, go outside, Paige, up against the wall. There's no one to see you. Yes, but you're being very rude to everyone. It's an idea that I want to say might help you in some little way. Well, well why did you say so? Out with it, man! Spit it out! Trolls need lots of things to eat to make their sad small lives complete. <laughs> Oh, they're not the only ones. But if what he needs, we provide, perhaps he'll let us all inside. Give stuff to that ugly little twerp. No use, <laughs> Your Majesty. I think it's more likely that your page, future chief knight, the offspring of noble folk, the, the one with the brains, is suggesting you exert some leverage. Bribery, you mean? Mmm, I like the sound of that. Find the pots and pans in the kitchen. Abigail and Longsword in the gardens? I wonder what's going on here. Our love is blind to fear As we know love must be Whenever she is near I use my heart to see a lovely face and eyes no true heart ever lies she is the place What I... 
Find the pots and pans in the kitchen. Find the pots and pans in the... That troll is a truly horrid beast, but I'm sure you can get past it. I want you to get me some cream cakes. Ah, my type of man. Cream cakes and a cup of tea. No, I can do you a nice sprig of heather. Uh, no thank you. Bring your luck. I don't need luck. No! as such. Got something better, though. Ah, good. And what are they? <laughs> Some live rats. Live rats? Ha! Huh. They're not better than cream cakes. You should see the cream cakes they serve up round here. Cream cakes? No, I haven't. Cream cakes? No, I haven't. 
have not. Anyway, you shouldn't be eating cream cakes. You should be on a diet. If I had, I wouldn't let you have them. Have you any cream cakes? Yes. Well, can I have some? Oh, I don't know about that. Well, can I buy some? Oh, I've not sold any before. Well, what do you do with them? Well, I eat them, of course. Oh, you can have some. Here, have a few. Gosh, oh, that's rather kind. Cream cakes. <laughs> Lovely cream cakes. <laughs> I want you to get some taste for this sore, decrepit mouth of mine. Try the dentist, silly. Um, excuse me, uh, are you taking them all out? No, only the one. Ah, well, uh, you see, I, I need a... Well, I, I, I think I need a full set. Well, I'll have to ask the patient first. <clears throat> Would you let this man have your teeth? Only if you get five gold coins for the dentist. I'm afraid I don't have any cash. Credit card will do. Oh, oh, right. Perfect. Please find some bellows. Please find some bellows. Your quest is to find out where the Princess Abigail has gone. To do this, you'll have to find the items I ask you for. They'll be hidden around the rooms of the castle. And lucky, that's... You just get the feeling of history. I mean, some of my ancestors suffered here at the hands of the king and his bad-tempered... forebears. If you could sum it up then, the expression would be moving. It moves you. Emotionally, from one feeling to another, often from one place to another. In the case of my family, from the pond to the cauldron. You have to look at these people and wonder. Once past the troll, they approached the base of the tower. I can't see how we're going to get up there. Got no elevating powers, no means of climbing tall stone towers. Why can't you talk like the rest of us? Never mind. Longsword! I talk the way the best men do, just not the same as all of you. Blow me on if you ask me. Long sword! Yes, sir. How do we get up there, then? Uh, well, I'd say we should use that, sir. A mangonel? Jolly good. Uh, how? Well, if we climb into the scoop, one by one, we can hurl ourselves up to the top. The boy's mad. If we want to make the top, then I can't see what choice we got. You can go first, then, Jonathan. Well... Who's going to go first, then? I'm going to cheat and leave the others to it. <laughs> but you'll have to help them. When you're ready, then, I figure you'll press down on that old trigger. Try 
harder. Whoopee! Whoopee! Oops! Missed again! Huh. Call yourself a soldier! Go Super King! When you're ready, then I figure you press down on the trigger. It's again. Aim me careful, cause if you don't, I'll be squashed against that stone. Whoops. Well, you know. Me. Aim me careful, cause if you don't, I'll be squashed against that stone. Oh dear. A bit to left, a bit to right. Take careful aim before the flight. Are you getting bored? I'm sure that I shouldn't be doing this. Oh. Remind me never to ask you for directions. Missed again. Just pull the trigger. I could do a lot better than this. Oh, the ground is such a lovely place to be. Oh. I wish you was in here on the receiving end. This is hard work. You may be enjoying this, but I'm not. When I figure you press down on that old trigger. Have you got a problem? Well, the ground is such a lovely place to be. Oh, do try harder. Oh, the ground is such a lovely place to be. Oh. Ah, shame that. Aim me careful, cause if you don't, I'll be squashed against that stone. Oh, do try harder. Oh, the ground is such a lovely place to be. You could aim this time. Come on, come on. This is hard work. Would you like to say please enter a name for your saved session? May I close my eyes? Oh! Oops! Missed again! I'm sure that I shouldn't be doing this. That. Oh, get on with it! Oh, Bored. 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 You're not really going to do that, are you? Oh. Bull should know. It's here I go, man. Here I go. Oh dear. Too good at this, are we? One thing that you all should know is here I go, man, here I go. You try concentrating this time. You're supposed to be a big brain. Oh, not you again. Aim me careful, cause if you don't, I'll be squashed against that stone. You may be enjoying this, but I'm not. Oh, get on with it. Aim me careful, cause if you don't, I'll be squashed against that stone. Oh dear.
Whoopee! When you're ready for that figure, you press down on that old trigger. A bit to left, a bit to right, take careful aim before you fly. I... This is hard work. Whoopee! You may be enjoying this, but I'm not. A bit to left, a bit to right. Careful aim before the flight. Remind me never to ask you for directions. When you're ready, then I figure you'll press down on that old trigger. Oops! Missed again! Whoopee! Whoopee! Oops! Missed again! A bit to left, a bit to right. Take careful aim before the flight. Whoops, missed. One thing that you all should know is here I go, man, here I go. Whoopee! Oh, don't try harder. A bit to left, a bit to right. Take careful aim before the flight. Um, um, um. Aim me careful, cause if you don't, I'll be squashed against that stone. Whoopee! Oh dear. Whoopee! Whoopee! Whoops! Missed again! Whoopee! 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 Again! Again. Again. A bit to left, a bit to right. Take careful aim before the flight. Whoops. Missed again. A bit to left, a bit to right. Take careful aim before the flight. Oh, don't try harder. Whoopee. Whoops. Well, you know. When you're ready, then I figure you press down on that old trigger. Again! 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 One thing that you all should know is here I go, man, here I go. When you're ready, then I figure you press down on that old trigger. One thing that you all should know is here I go, man, here I go. You may be enjoying this, but I'm not. Aim me careful, cause if you don't, I'll be squashed against that stone. Whoops! Well, you know. Whoopee! Oh dear. When you're ready, then I figure you press down on that old trigger. Whoopee! You've got to throw the king, the page, the queen and longsword over the wall and up, up, up into that tower. To do this, you're going to use the mangonel. That's a medieval catapult, you know. And to throw a character, click on the mangonel bowl when the cursor is a hand. Hold the mouse button down and drag the mouse towards you. Release the mouse button whenever you're ready. Concentrate. Aim me careful, cause if you don't, I'll, I'll be squashed against that stone. Aim me careful, cause if you don't, I'll be squashed against that stone. You try concentrating this time. Aim me careful, cause if you don't, I'll be squashed against that stone. Whoops! Missed again. When you're ready, then I figure you press down on that old trigger. A bit to left, a bit to right. Take careful aim before the flight. 
When you're ready, then I figure you press down on that old trigger. When I figure you press down on that old trigger. Whoops, missed. Whoopee! Whoopee! Oh, don't try harder. Aim me careful, cause if you don't, I'll be squashed against that stone. A bit to right, take careful aim before the flight. Not you again. A bit to left, a bit to right, take careful aim before the flight. A polka dot smock is hardly my taste, but it might help you. A polka dot smock is hardly my taste, but it might help you. Would you like to say please enter a name for your saved session? They all landed safely at the top of the tower, ready to make their next move. What do we do now? Well, I, uh, I, I suppose we uh, find the princess. I know that, you idiot! But how? Well, we follow them. Marvellous. Yes, as a matter of fact, it is marvellous. All we have to do is to follow them to where they've taken Abigail. No, hurry up about it. The baseball starts soon. Really? She's a nice girl and all that, but is it really worth it? What? How could you speak of your daughter like that? Of course it's worth it. Oh, what a... Uh, I suppose so. Uh, I'm just disappointed. I'm, I, I thought we were going to find her. And all, and all we get is a long walk. You're just worried about the baseball. Well, there's that as well. Jolly dark down here. There only seems to be one way out. Well, what shall we do? Go through it? Hmm? I thought you were supposed to be stupid. Right, off you go. What? Me go down there? Never! It's a night's job. Should think any night worth his salt would plunge into the darkness without a thought. Uh, yes, well, under normal circumstances I would, of course, but, uh, well, it's... Well, not normal circumstances. You're frightened? Well, no, not fear, exactly. More... <laughs> Terror. Uh, sheer, absolute terror. Isn't this a job for a page? Think he slipped outside, old chap? Off you go! Oh, get out of the way! I'll go! Well, what now? Well, I think we, uh, we ought to follow, really, sir. Wait for any screams first. Come on, you cowards! Cowards? Us? Don't be silly! Is it safe? It's the dungeons. Every castle has its secret passages. Most are accessed via a trapdoor. Find one. I think that Lucky has been spying again. All this fuss over a sheep's stealer. I shall lock the lot of them up and throw away the key. Every castle has its secret passages. Most are accessed via a trapdoor. Find one. Every castle has its secret Definitely. 
Dorothy wouldn't want to see that. <laughs>
that you all should know. Here I go, man. Here I go. <laughs> oh, yuck. <laughs> <laughs> it's disgusting. Landscapes are beautiful, but where would you find such a view? Landscapes are beautiful, but where would you find... Once out of the Gunji dungeons, they found themselves at the base of a large mountain. Yes, sir. You're too old for this. You should have stayed at home and looked after the goldfish. <laughs> Nonsense! I love a good battle! Yes, but we're bound to be outnumbered. All the soldiers that must have been in that castle. Never! Bit of blood and plunder never hurt anyone! That noise you heard is Blackheart's men. Thousands of them in their den. Their campfires light the evening sky. I can't see how we'd make it by. I, uh, I'm, uh... I'm sure there's another way. What? But you just said that you loved a bit of blood and plunder. Did I? Oh, well. Any ideas, Muggins? It's odd that at times like this you rely upon those to whom you are rudest. Uh, not wishing to be childish, however, and bearing in mind that the Princess Abigail is our prime concern, I advise you to use your ears. Ears? What are you talking about, man? Listen, and you will hear. I know that, you fool! What will I hear? You will hear the gap in their line of defences. There is always one. Where there is no sound, there are no men. Head through that gap and behind them. This is bound to be a rear guard. Uh, the troop of the princess will be in front. Ah! Found it! Break camp, chaps! Timing is of the essence, and I possess a device of sand to assist with this. Timing is of the essence.
want you to find an axe. Now, where do you suppose you've seen one of those? As the sun rose, they continued on their way towards the head of Blackheart's troop. should know by now that plan won't work. Not anyhow. What? I, I suppose there are rather a lot. We should get one of those chainsaw thingies. You can't just chop the trees down here. Ain't you heard about the atmosphere? Depletion of that ozone layer. All them rainforests everywhere. Would someone tell me what on earth this page is talking about? Never mind. Muggins! Yes, your magisterial grumpiness. What now? Do I ask me all the time? Because it's your job. I suspect that a tall tree will be helpful. Climbing it will enable you to see. Then you can continue on your way. Being rude as usual, no doubt. So you'll need the tallest tree. Good. And which one is that? I think that even you could work that one out. All right, all right. No. That one? Uh, no. It's that one. Uh, that one over there. Right. Come on. Well, now what? I think that someone should climb the tree and see what's to be seen. <laughs> Blooming marvellous, isn't it? Magician, page boy, knight of the order of St. Hilda, patron saint of abandoned hedgehogs, all paid a fortune and nothing. Why? Cost that bit of a drop and tucker, and she figures it out way ahead of all of them. Slightly ahead of you as well, dear. Well, I, I was waiting just to see who would figure it out first. Who's going up there, then? It looks uh, very high. Very high indeed. Are you scared, Longsword? Oh, no, no. It's just all this armor. Uh, couldn't get it all the way up there. It'd take hours to take off and uh, put back on again. I'll go, you wimps. I can see a fire burning on the horizon. There are some soldiers, and I'm sure that Abigail's horse is next to them. Marvellous! Another hour till first strike. We should just make it. But there's a stream in the way. Muggins, how on earth are we going to get downstream? How should I know? Any ideas, anyone? Well, that boat looks interesting. A sailor, perhaps, but I'm not a sailor and I have no intention of becoming one. Now, start thinking. He means that we could sail it across the river. Your rudeness. Oh, I see what you mean. The lovely Princess Abigail keeps a jug of water. Find it. The lovely Princess Abigail keeps a jug of water. Find it. like to please enter a name for your saved session. You know, I'm really not that fond of water. Well, only for making potions and things that go kazam and kaboom and shower smoke and steam and bubbles and all sorts. <clears throat> yes, well, you know.
looks terribly deep. Somehow, this is no longer funny. Without a simple up. I can't swim, you know. Aren't we going a little uh, fast? Without a simple up. I can't swim, you know. Somehow, this is no longer funny. Aren't we going a little uh, fast? This is ridiculous. Oh, I'm getting wet. Mop yourself down, Jonathan. You're soaking. Is everyone here and safe, Longsword? Uh, yes, Your Majesty. Look for the horse-drawn wagon. A river got in the way, and an exhilarating boat ride later, they all emerged on the other bank. A little damp, but of hearty spirit. This is it, then. Ten of them, I make it. Uh, yes, sir, uh, I do, too. What now? We fight them, I suppose. Uh, you want to fight them? Oh, I see. Uh, you don't think that perhaps there are just a teensy weensy few, uh, uh, one or two, you know, too many of them? Uh, just slightly, I mean. It's not that I'm impressed by big bulging muscles and sharp shiny swords that could slice you in two like a bacon slicer in a deli or anything. It's just that, well, maybe the odds are just slightly uneven. Don't you think? Well, that's I haven't thought of that. Then I, I, I would miss the first strike. Muggins! What do you think? It really is staggering, isn't it? You see a line of soldiers and all you can talk about is fighting. Not only that, but you talk about fighting them all at once. You don't think strategically, magically, around the problem. OK, big brain, what do you suggest? It seems to me that this is the time for a bit of magic. Magic. Don't do it, Magic. Clear? As mud, old chap. As mud. I'll zap them with my wand. Then you can help me. Peek-a-boo. 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 a shield flanked by some flags in the hall. 
Would you like to please enter a name for your saved session? There is a shield flanked by some flags. Some knights were stoutly defended by their shields, but they were overcome by persistence and skill, and Abigail's coach was for the taking. So, while all this is going on, while the king, the queen, and all that happy band is struggling to find the poor kidnapped creature, Muggins' plan was at work. Maybe you'll guess. Maybe you won't. A joke. All this way, all those battles, riddles, Puzzles, not to mention missing the game, and now, no princess. Why not ask your court jester? What court jester? The one with the brains. Oh, Muggins. Your Majesty? Work it out for us, would you? Muggins, old chap. Your Majesty's tone seems almost pleasant. Uh, is there a reason for this? Well, I, I've, I've had enough Muggins, me old footer. I just want my daughter back. And what about the baseball? Oh, doesn't seem so important suddenly. In fact, <laughs> I think I've gone off the game. Not, not right, not, not when, well, who knows what's happening to her. Good Lord! You mean you've known where she was all along? Well, yes, actually, I have. Right. Got no choice, then. Let's get on with it. You mean you're not going to chop my head off? Of course not! <laughs> just tell me where she is. At the castle. But we've just come from the castle. Not that castle. Well, which... Oh, you mean... Exactly. You mean our castle. But if she's back at the castle, then someone must be holding her captive there. What? Holding her captive in my very own castle? It's disgraceful! Someone will have to race on ahead and help her. Ah, lucky, there you are. You go on ahead and find her. Make sure she's in no danger. You mean me? Danger? I have allergies, you know. <laughs> <laughs> my nose starts to run. My eyes water. I sneeze. Hey, and you know, one of the things I'm allergic to, you got it, danger. I'll stay here if you don't mind. All right. I'll cut a deal with you. Deal? We may be onto something. The big pond. The big pond? You mean the one with them aggressive swans on it? The swans? No more. All gone. Big pond for little you. You play dirty, huh? Okay, I'm on my way. Ain't nothing mucky, I'm lucky to ducky. To get back to the castle, you must find Abigail's shoes. We've, uh, well, you've found her. I wonder what the king will have to say. The group of brave rescuers storm back to the king's castle. Oh, my darling, where have you been? Um, er, uh, me? Well, I've... I've been here. Here? All the time? Well, yes. What, what do you mean? Oh, oh, I give up. What's been happening? Well... I, uh, I'd better go and take off this silly armor. <laughs> Besides, I, 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 I think I need the uh, uh, bathroom. <laughs> Stand still, man. Uh, yes, Your Majesty. Long sword. Your Majesty. You! Me? 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 Yes, you, Long sword. It was you. Me, Your Majesty? Yes, you, Long sword. I bet. I, I, I'm, I'm not sure that this is what's called being in the right place at the right time. I definitely need to go to the bathroom now. Oh, I can't stand this. Of course it wasn't him. Wasn't him? Well, who then?
again. It was us. I love Sir Longsword. Sir Willoughby, Herringbone, Scratchel Longsword. Knight of the Order, St. Hilda, patron saint of the Bandit Hedgehogs. Yes, Mother, I love him. And he loves me. That squirt! He's not a squirt. He's a kind, brave, honorable knight. Fearless and true, and we love each other. It was that attitude to him that made us, made us fake. A kidnap. You faked the kidnap? Well, I suppose he has got his own teeth. His own teeth and a wonderful stamp collection. Longsword! Well, uh, I suppose that now that you mention it, there may be just a little bit of, uh, some truth in it. What now, Mother? Better ask your father, I suppose. The king? Ask the king? Uh, you think I should ask the king? You think I should go in there, say, morning, king, old chap. Uh, by the way, I want to marry your daughter. Uh, maybe I should say, uh, hello there. How's the game? Oh, by the way, you know that daughter of yours? Uh, Abigail, is it? Uh, could I marry her? <laughs> uh, 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 I mean, what's a daughter between friends? Oh, I need the bathroom. Oh, go on, Smudger. Smudger? Smudger? Well, if you think I should. Bunny Snap. Bunny Snap? Now, what do you want, man? Well, sir, I... I... Hurry up, man! It's getting exciting! I want your... ...daughter's hand. Oh, have it, me old fruit. But you can't cook, can't clean, can't even boil an egg. As useful as a chocolate teapot, mark you. <laughs> Can eat a chocolate teapot. You mean... Yes. Of course I do. Let me know the date. Oh, oh, thank you. Oh, thank you, sir, from the bottom of my heart. Yes, yes. Up of your knees, man, and out of the way. I can't see. Oh, and that, uh, that gold we took with us. Yes? Better have it. Dari and all that. Oh, sir. Oh, king. Oh, your majesty. Oh, sir, majesty king. You're, oh, you've made me the happiest man in the world. I'll always be in your... Oh, don't get sentimental on me. The game's starting. Bunny snap. Smudger. Bunny snap. Smudger. Bunny snap. Smudger. I feel sick. And they all lived happily, comfortably, safely, warmly, quietly, considerately, and peacefully, with a minimum of upset and a comfortable sort of living standard, with good food and loyal servants, watching the baseball together on Saturday <laughs> afternoons with hot roasted chestnuts or an ice cream soda, then catching up with the soaps and discussing politics and the state of the nation and producing enough grandchildren for the grumpy old king to start his own football team, and he got less and less irascible, that's a good word, irascible, as he got older and time strolled by, and he slowly learned to enjoy his family and even to take part in Thanksgiving. Even once, just once, mind, he bought Muggins a present, a diamond-tipped magic wand with green and red stripes all the way down it, wrapped in gold and silver. <laughs>
Princess. Well done. You've solved the mystery of the missing princess. Mm, but I suppose you think you've finished. Well, you have done well. But there are many other puzzle combinations, tricks, songs, animations yet to be enjoyed. And then there's the castle itself. Why not keep searching?